Suppose that this is our business, gym and spa. And our gym and spa has the assets, liabilities, and equity. This is the accounting equation of our gym and spa. Okay? So now, uh, we know that uh, assets are debit, liabilities and equity are credit. Okay. First is the transaction with the owner. Okay. This one thing is we would like to see, okay, the effects of the financial transaction. Okay. This will be, we will describe here the financial transaction. The effects of the financial transaction in the accounting equation. Okay. So first transaction with the owner is investment. Okay. This is the financial transaction, okay? A description of the investment, okay? A description of this investment. Here, the financial transaction is the owner invested cash of 200000 in the business. Okay. So, as we have discussed, the journal entry, okay? Um, there is a debit and credit. And we have also learned that if this is our business, we debit what the business receive and we credit what the business give. So in this case, what do you think the business receive? This is the owner invested cash of 200000 in the business. The business received 200000 from the owner, correct? So we debit cash because say invested cash so we debit cash of 200,000 okay and we what we are giving to the owner we are giving ownership in the business so we will credit what we give which is the ownership and that will be owner's capital in accounting okay so cash is what we receive and we gave the business gave owners capital ownership in the business okay it means that the owner that the uh, capital it is owned by the owner okay here so if we will reflect this uh, entry okay it, we will reflect this is actually the journal entry okay here, the journal entry, as we have discussed in the previous slide, it has to have a date, so you can put a date here, and an explanation. So, in the meantime, uh, we will concentrate on the account and on the amount of the entry, okay, in this illustration. So, if we are going to uh, analyze this entry, this is our journal entry, okay? If we will analyze this entry in the accounting equation, it means that there is an increase in asset of cash of 200000 There was an increase because it's debit, okay? And in owner's capital, it's credit, so there will be an increase in capital by 200000 So A1 is this. A1, A, owner, and it re 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 in relation to investment, A1. So here, there is a credit of capital uh, by 200000 And here, A1, there is an increase in cash by 200000 Okay? So next, with the, with the uh, owner, withdrawal of investment. If the owner withdraw, withdrew investment, okay, what did the business receive if the owner will withdraw? The business receives reduction of owner. Oh, by the way, this is the transaction. The owner withdrew 500 from the business. This is the financial transaction. This is the major classification of the transaction, major uh, type of transaction. And the specific transaction is the owner withdrew 500 from the business. So in this case, the owner withdrew 500. So the business, okay, received what? The business received reduction of the ownership 
Okay? So in this case, we will debit owner's drawing. Okay? Because owner's drawing is a withdrawal by the owner. It is reducing the capital. And what did the business give? The business gave the owner cash of 500 Okay? So here, we in, uh, there is a reduction here in capital in the, by debiting owner's drawing because it's a debit. And there is a reduction in cash by 500 because we are crediting it. So if we will uh, reflect this in the accounting equation, we will have a debit of owner's drawing. So there will be a reduction here in capital by 500. So A2, owner, then withdrawal, the type of uh, transaction. Okay, and then cash, there will also be a reduction in cash by 500. Okay, so if you will look at your uh, accounts, your accounting equation, 200 minus 500, that will be 199,500. Similarly, that's also the total here, 199,500. Okay, let's move on. Then let's discuss uh, the transaction with, with financial institution or banks. Okay, this is our business, the gym and spa. Okay. And our financial transaction is we will borrow money from the bank. So this is the financial transaction. The owner borrowed 100000 from the bank for the business. So if this business borrowed 100,000 from the bank, what will the business receive? The business will receive cash by 100,000. What did the business give in this transaction? What will the business give? The business will give its promise to pay the 100,000. And in accounting, that promise to the bank is called loans payable. Okay? So here, if we will uh, reflect this transaction in our accounting equation, uh, the gym and spa receive cash. Okay? B1, B1. Okay? B, financial institution, one is borrowed money. B1, so we debit cash, we, we are increasing cash, and we credit liability, so we are increasing also liability by 100,000. So in this case, in our accounting equation, there is an increase in cash, which is an increase in assets, and there is an increase in liabilities. Okay, so both sides of the equation has an increase, okay? Okay, so if we borrow the next transaction here, so we will pay the loan. So if we will pay the loan, okay, this is the transaction. Pay the bank 5000 as partial payment. So when we pay the loan, what did the business receive? The business received reduction of the loan. Okay, this is the loan and we are debiting it. We are reducing we are decreasing our liability, okay? And what did the business uh, give? The business gave, because it's payment to the bank, the business gave what? The business gave cash of 5,000, okay? So if we will input this in this uh, accounting equation, Loans payable, there is a debit. We are debiting loans payable of 5000 Okay, so here, debit loans payable, okay, 5000 So it's a reduction of the loan and credit cash, 5000 So here, there is a reduction of cash also. Okay, next. With a supplier. Okay, this is our business. 
Okay, and our transaction is buy in cash. Okay, and this is the transaction. Bought equipment worth 8000 in cash. So what did the business receive from the supplier? The business received equipment worth 8000 So we debit equipment, okay, because we are increasing the asset, okay? What did the business give? The business gave cash of 8000 so we are reducing our cash by 8000 so in this case if we are going to reflect these financial tra transactions in our accounting equation we debit equipment so we are increasing equipment by 8000 and we credit cash so we are reducing cash by 8000 so in this there is a there is an increase in asset by 8000 there is also a decrease in another form of asset by 8000 so here positive 8 minus 8000 is 0 so there is it's still equal because there is no transaction on this side okay next is buy on account and this is the transaction purchase furniture amounting 5000 on account okay so if we purchase furniture amounting 5000 remember this is on account so what did the business receive the business received furniture worth 5000 and what did the business give to the supplier the business gave what a promise to pay okay and if we are dealing with the supplier the name the account that we are going to use is a liability account called accounts payable we are dealing with suppliers vendors okay and creditors the account that we are going to use our obligations or liability is accounts payable if we are dealing with a bank it's loans payable or notes payable but with a bank we don't use accounts payable okay so accounts payable the obligation to the supplier um, creditors and vendors we use accounts payable so in this case if we are going to post this in our I mean record this in our accounting equation we will increase furniture by 5,000 and we will likewise increase uh, liability by 5,000 so in this case our equation is balanced there is an increase in asset and there is an increase in liability and we have to pay this if we were going to pay the account so the transaction is paid 50% of the, of the account for furniture 50% of 5,000 is 2,500. So meaning we will pay that. So what did the business receive? The business received reduction of the payable. And what did the business give? The business gave cash as payment of the account. So in this case, if we will put, put this or record this in the accounting equation, there is a reduction of accounts payable by 2500 and there is a reduction of cash by 2500 okay so that is our illustration of journal entries if you have questions please let me know okay just 